09 Audi S5 uh, as an ABS uh, issue. Um, I have a code. Let me just see if I can uh, show you this one here. 00283 left front ABS wheel speed sensor. It's electrical, it says electrical uh, malfunction in the circuit. So it looks like the computer sees that there is an electrical issue. It could be open uh, circuit or short to ground or something. So I already did a lot of testing here. I'm just going to give you the conclusion. I did test the um, I did test the a ABS sensor. I test this uh, ABS sensor wire. Um, most of the problem usually goes here on those joints. There is one here and there is one up here. So what I did, just to make sure this wire is good, I went up here. Let's see if I can get a better. Okay. So I went all the way up here, you can see the tab. I just remove uh, some of the insulator without damaging the, the wires. I wanna just connect uh, my, uh, con my ohm meter and I did continuity test between the ABS sensor harness right here, uh, pink and yellow. So I did pink to pink here, it gave me zero. I did also yellow to yellow here, it gave me zero. So that means everything in between, it's good. There is no open circuit in those joints. So that means this wire up to here is good. Okay, however, um, also I just wanna make sure, one, I'm gonna give you uh, one tip here. The driver side front uh, ABS sensor is the same sensor on the rear uh, passenger side and the right side uh, speed sensor is the same as the the wheel speed sensor or the ABS sensor is the same as the rear driver so the driver the rear driver and the front passenger are the same sensor the front driver and the rear passenger are the same sensor, so they are X. Okay, so you start with the one from the side of the X to the other side is the same, and the same way the other, the other way around. So let's just go here. Okay, so let me start the car it says ESP a <coughs> ABS full so you can see both lights are on raise the ABS light on okay so I'm gonna try to delete the codes Uh, it's clear it is off yes yes <coughs> okay so it says no fault detected Let's just um, confirm this one more time. Let's go out of the screen and just go. I can't control this area, it's too tight here. All right, let's do um, escape again. Okay, go to brakes, see if the codes come back again on his trouble codes. Okay, the course is still in, even I don't delete them, but it's still in, and the ABS light is still on. <clears throat> Alright, so let me go escape here, escape again. 
All right, so let me show you what I found. Problem with this car. All right. So here is the power steering uh, reservoir, right here. Under it, and you see the ABS module, it's right here. Okay, this is the hydraulic pump and the module is here. And if you see the harness here, I already removed the tip of the harness. And if you notice here, let me see if I can, let's give you a better view. This is the power steering reservoir and I already took the tip of the thing and look at this yellow and pink wire. Do you see this? They are married to each other. There is no insulation on them. For some reason, what I think happened there was some oil, some sort of oil leak, whatever there. It came onto these things and ate away the insulator. Look, look how it, it just come out in pieces. Look at this. So both ABS sensor wires are married to each other. They're touching each other here. And if you see here, this is the pink and yellow. It's the same as the one here, so this is the problem. I'm gonna disconnect as much as I can here. I'm gonna remove as much as I can tape from here until the beeling stops. Because these are, let me see here. So this is keep, keeps coming off, look at this. Look at this. So I have to go all the way until this is stops. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna keep uh, untaping this until I'm able to have a good solid insulator on those wires. Okay. So let me do this and I'll come back in a minute. I'm gonna ha isolate this, oh, separate this wire from each other. And you can see it look like this other wire sensor, they are like braided with each other. Okay. Okay, so I was able to, to reach all the way up to here to the top of the fender where I can see the uh, the insulator is, is now it doesn't build anymore, and the other same way here, close to the. Uh, you see this power steering reservoir hose. No more peeling. So I'm, what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna put just for a test, for I have him uh, secured. I'm gonna put just um, wire between each the yellow, yellow, and uh, pink and pink. Okay, I'm just gonna put the alligator here, just for testing. Bring this around here. So then I want to com confirm. I'll just secure him. This is for the yellow, and this is the yellow. Okay, so now. This thing here, I cut it. You can see it, how there are no insulation here whatsoever. Okay, so let's, um, let's go back to the car and um, see what happened. All right. Okay, now inside the car, 
and I'm gonna just turn the ignition on for now. Turn the light off. EBS on. It turned off. Okay. So. Let's turn the ignition off again. On again. Alright, it turned off right away. Okay, let me now go to the codes. Brakes. Trouble codes. Okay, clear. Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's scale again. Let's go back again. Trouble codes. No cause detected. Again, let me exit the whole system. Control unit, brakes. Trouble codes. No fault, that's it. Okay, so now let's start the car. The slide is on because I have the car on the uh, on the jack right now, and the wheel is hanging. So let me go again. Turn the switch on. ABS light is on. Oh, start again. No more light. Okay, so I mean all the lights are off right now. That's it, service do that, we can take care of this later. It needs a uh, washer fluid, that's fine. Hood is open, the door is open. That's it, no more messages. This is fixed, and no more codes. So the problem was there by... Uh, the ABS module or the ABS uh, hydraulic pump under the power ceiling is a reservoir. That wiring was the issue. So this is fixed. Thank you for watching. If this uh, video was helpful, uh, please, you know, just give me something uh, to feel happy about my work. A thumb up or a like, or uh, just share, subscribe. I appreciate your time. It did take me a lot of time to figure, to figure out what the issue is. It, it was not that easy. I have to remove a lot of parts, I have to remove lot, the shrouds, I have to move everything. It was not easy. I mean, it, it might show easy in the video, but it was not that easy to, to go that far. To get to the, to, the, to, the, to the point where is the problem, where I find the problem. I nailed it, and that's the issue was there. Thank you for watching.